Hi, so you want to learn how to do serial wire debug. So follow this tutorial and you will learn how. First of all, you will have to connect the jumper wires as I show you. Then you will have to connect the cables exactly as I show you um, in the ST link and in the blue pill board. Afterwards, you will, if you have an STM board different than mine, you can go to internet search the datasheet and then search information using the command F command in your computer. Here you can see that SWD used uh, for, for other things other than debugging. So it's why you have to select it afterwards as the, as, as, as the debugging pin and not as other pins. So you will have to search the SWD and the SWV clock. Afterwards, you can open STM32 QBD, and uh, after you open it, you will have to select your board, um, create the environment, and then in the IOC file, go to Sys. In the, in the JPAO, go to Sys, and then uh, select Serial Wire. In autom automatically, it will. Uh, enable the dual pins so in, in theory you shouldn't go and search in the data sheet the, the pins but it's good to know them because then you can do the connections uh, well afterwards we will make a short program that increases uh, uh, the letter e of one each each cycle so uh, we can debug it following these these instructions that i show you here and after we debug it we will see the a letter E that will increment of one each time I click in the play button. So here we can see all the all the windows that I made to show information. Here you can select your windows, and yeah, I will toggle the break ones when where I want the program to to stop, and so to the back the program. Afterwards, I will make start the program, and you will see that E increments of one every time. Other than that, we can also see the registers, that, that it's very useful, and we can see that uh, the register 3 is the one that it's used to increment and to save the value of the letter E. This is all, guys. If you want to see other videos, you can see my other videos. At the moment, I only did this one, but tell me what you thought about it, and uh, I'll make some other English videos. I am sorry for my accent, but I am not uh, English and I will try to learn better during my next videos. Thank you for watching and see you next time.